You're watching 13 on your side. Today, the company that owns the 130 year old popular breakfast brand Aunt Jemima announced plans to change the name and remove the image that has been criticized as a racial stereotype. 13 on your side, Sarah Makuta spoke to a local brand expert today about why these changes are finally happening now. Making national headline today, PepsiCo announced it's changing the name of longtime breakfast brand Aunt Jemima in light of their support and pledge to the Black Lives Matter movement. Now, this is the trend we're seeing happen more and more among brands. Well, the experts that I spoke to today say this is just the beginning. That announcement today from the parent company of Quaker Oats shows the change can happen. I personally think that it's, again, a great start. Eric Lachey is the creative director at Carbon Stories. He says changing a brand's image or logo could cost a company millions of dollars, but says that's a small price to pay to communicate the right message to the world. So Chaco Footwear specifically, uh, we were working on a project with them for their global brand conference. Um, it was great to see them respond in a good way. You can go to their Facebook, Instagram, social media, and see what their response was. They realized that it is an issue in the outdoor industry of having uh, segregation, not being very diverse. And so I'm grateful that they're not only putting their money where their mouth is, but then they also are showing their support. So like if your brand was a person, what would they say? You know, like you pretty much have to figure out how your brand can actually take those kind of stances. So why now? Brand expert Ginny Seaforth of Seaforth PR says it's just the right thing to do. Brands as a whole are having to realize that they have a social responsibility to help change the way we think. She says brands like Aunt Jemima are being challenged through shelf space and says brands need to prove their value to consumers. Today, more than ever, consumers want to know what's behind the brand. And that's a really important issue. Consumers don't want to buy products that, where the company is not treating its people well, not treating the environment well, not serving the community well. And, and that is just really what it's all about. Sarah Makuda, 13 on your side.